Right, hello everyone. Um, I'm standing in the conservatory and we've had a bit of bad news. Uh, we thought, basically the conservatory goes out 3.2 metres and we wanted to, and we are, we're planning on bricking it up. Um, and we thought we might get away with because it's an existing structure, just replacing it and the council saying, yeah, it's fine. They've come back to say, no, that's not fine. So, um, the other bit of bad news, um, which is, the testing of the foundation, which I think you, you've seen, our builder dug down there, the foundations aren't strong enough. So, with those two bits of bad news combined, what we're now planning on doing is uh, just knocking this down and under permitted development, bringing it to three meters. Um, so it won't go at uh, three point, you know, just reducing it by 20 centimeters that side. Um, yeah, under PD, but going a little bit further along, um, more towards, the end of this window so we sort of gain back that size anyway um, but the foundation is going to need to be redone or done again um, to yeah to be able to do this so it should actually speed up the process if you don't have to get plan in and wait sort of three months or whatever uh, but it is gonna it does and has brought up the costs of the project so um, bit of bad news there um, other than that this week I think we've had uh, a delivery of um, sanitary wear, but some items items have gone missing. So there are bits on site, like toilets and stuff like that, but uh, I think there's like shower trays and all that sort of stuff and showers, but I think four cabinets and four something else as well hasn't been delivered, so that's annoying. Um, I think our builder met uh, the electric company to decide what we're doing with this because obviously you can't have your electric meter and fuse board inside a toilet. So yeah, that, that needs to be moved. Um, so I think, I don't actually think, I've got a really bad feeling from what Alicia's been saying when she's been here this week. I don't actually think much else has happened this week. Um, and to be honest, I'm not actually sure why. I can guess, I can guess why, but without uh, speaking to the builder, which I want to do first before I say anything, um, yeah, I just don't know. Nothing else has really happened, I'm afraid. So, bit of a rubbish, uh, a rubbish update. Um, but we've, we're starting to finalise budgets. I think that's a that's the thing we sort of said on episode two um, about the, the, the complications. We still haven't actually got the final prices, but last night we sent the client everything we've got so far, bar, handyman, stuff like that. Um, so it's pretty much exactly there. So now the client can budget and stuff like that, which um, I'll, I'll, I'll save all the financials till the end of the project, stuff like that. But yeah, a bit of a short one. So, bad news really, so actually it's a bad week, so I'm not gonna hide anything, it's been a really bad week. Bad news on the foundations and the council saying no to that. Um, bad news on the showered stuff not being delivered here properly. And bad news on, I don't know why, works have not progressed, but um, I'll update you why as to why next week. I guess that's, that's the uh, that's developments, isn't it? You, you can't be full steam ahead all the time, there's got to be reasons and things happen like stuff doesn't get delivered and bad news comes up, but um, there we go. See you next time.